Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of the Atari Texas YouTube channel. Well, about a week ago, a company called Coleco Holdings started a Kickstarter where they're releasing two new mini arcade machines. So let's go back in time a little bit. There was a company called Coleco in the 1980s and they made a lot of mini arcade games. They were really good. I mean, there were games like Donkey Kong, Frogger, Pac-Man, you know, all the classics. And these little tabletop mini arcade machines were really fun to play with. So the company today called Coleco Holdings is releasing two new ones and they started a Kickstarter. One of them is Rainbow Bright and the other one is Robotech. Now they have an early bird special where you can buy Rainbow Bright right now for $45. Uh, the Robotech early releases um, already been sold out but you can buy it at $55. So far, um, in about the nine days that this Kickstarter has been going, they've already raised $65,000. So they've totally smashed their goal of what they wanted to raise um, to do this. Some of the features these two new mini arcade machines are going to have are full color LED display, a powerful new gaming chipset, revamped joystick and accurate action buttons, a rechargeable lithium battery, and highly detailed art wraps. They're also offering a couple limited editions, which, which are different colors of each one of these machines, if that's your, if you're interested in. These uh, mini arcades are set to ship in September of this year. So my question to all of you is, um, does this signal the return of Coleco? Um, you know, uh, this Kickstarter has done very well so far. And if it continues to do well and these things hit the retail stores and they do well in the retail stores, does that signal the return of Coleco? Now, I know a lot of people are hesitant to get into this Kickstarter based on the debacle of the Coleco Chameleon. But Coleco Holdings has already came out and said, hey, you know, as soon as we saw that this thing was going south with the Chameleon and our third party person that we were working with, we just immediately got out of this. Um, looks like a lot of people are, are taking that you know, and, and going with it. Um, it'll be really interesting to see how well these do beyond the Kickstarter, if these do well in the retail stores. I know, I think they were going to ask MSRP of $69 once they hit the retail store. So I don't know if that's kind of high, you know, I'm just, I'm interested in seeing how well that's going to do, especially for the casual gamer out there. So let me know if this is something you backed. Um, leave some comments uh, in the description below. Um, let me know what you think. Is this something you're going to back or is this something you're just, you know, hands off, you want nothing to do with it? And let me know. And I look forward to reading your comments. So thanks guys for watching. Thanks again for subscribing and we will catch you next time. Bye-bye.